obviously received a tremendous, uh, tremendous success in the past. Well, received it. He earned it, quite frankly. He's going to have to earn more than that here at the monthly in Hapro. Folks, just before we, uh, just before we kick things off, going to ask one time, Summer Hayes, hit him with the ad slides. Go ahead and follow us on all forms of social media, the Gaming Lab underscore on Instagram, Facebook.com slash the Gaming Lab, so you can keep up with all the going ons in the Philadelphia Smash scene at large. Of course, bros underscore calamity on Twitter. That's where you can do it. And uh, I was about to say 140 characters or less. That's not the case anymore. What is the character limit now? It's, it's Yeah, it might be 280. Yeah, they just doubled it. There you go. I mean, that's uh much like we much like we do at uh at Smash with Smash Ultimate. You gotta go big or go home, baby. And don't forget, the Philly Boss Rush is what's happening right now. This is part of the Philly Boss Rush circuit. You can money match one of the bosses of the area, and if you collect all eight badges, you get a chance to fight JRX for a chance at a, well, glory and riches. Codename Bears, that's our weekly every single Friday. That's every single Friday, and it's already going on. You see it here but it's going to be on twitch.tv slash class tournaments. That's where you're tuning in for that. Uno joining me on the microphone. The Lucas Pokemon trainer matchup. Psychedelic breaking out the young uh, the young Lucas. Yeah, um, Lucas um, being a very uh, different character coming from Smash 4, not having his grab combos or um, anything like that, but still kind of similar to the same game. Want to space out with PK Fire and... Um, um, spaces aerials so that you know like he's out of range of like Pokemon trainers things and stuff like that so yeah spacing himself out just fine however Ivysaur is a bit of a zoner as well with some options up close mm -hmm. however that Luke is very in your face and psychedelic it's not often that we see uh, that we see a Lucas getting broken out. Hits the Razor Leaf right back. Get that mess out of here, says Psychedelic. But the grab by I Dan the, the Man saying, yeah. don't give me that sass, young boy. Absolutely. Young man. I love the property of that forward smash that Lucas actually has. Being able to reflect any kind of projectile coming his way. Um, so it not only does it block the projectile, but we're going to send it back. So it makes you not want to spam your projectiles as much. You know, knowing that he has a reflector. So that's very um, useful in this matchup, of course. But Dan the Man showing that he's not afraid and he's doing a pretty well uh, job so far. Oh, the Flare Blitz <laughs> coming out from Dan the Man. No fear in that whatsoever. And that's going to be how Dan the Man takes stock number one. He draws first blood in this best of three clip. What a mix-up. Uh, that switch to Charizard immediately flare bl blitzing right out of the oh. Pokeball. It's like Charizard used, like, as soon as he came out, Charizard used flare blitz. Boom. Super <laughs> effective on the switch out, too. Absolutely. That yeah. is hard to do, man. Try that in the RPG, huh? <laughs> Absolutely. Ivysaur coming out once again. That's how he piled on a lot of the damage. And now the change of pace. Is that going to mix up Psychedelic? He's meeting those PK fires with the Razor Leafs and not doing uh, nearly enough to make Ivysaur stop using the Razor Leafs, quite frankly. Psychedelic, he's going to have the range to get back with the PK Thunder. The back throw will kill as well. He's sitting at 61%. And uh, right now, Dan oh, the man, man though, taking, as soon as he uh, came back, taking the advantage state all in his favor right now. Oh, and a fantastic read on the get-up roll with that back air. Now uh, with a whole stock lead up. Um, great yeah. job switching the uh, Squirtle too, you know, trying to get some of that chip damage as, you know, in low percent combos as we can see. But ops for the Ivy's are. I mean, this is essentially what it is, is extra credit. You know, you might as well pile on as much as you possibly can and the combo potential of Ivy Sword, nothing to be scoffed at as well. However, there's a... Uh, Oh my gosh, but, the ice, the PK freeze! <laughs> but you see a PK freeze coming from Psychedelic. Yeah, that was ridiculous. I mean, hey, you know what? Ice uh, ice is super effective against grass, so there's something to be said about that. But man, that was not something that Dan the Man was anticipating in the slightest. And just like that, we're at even. Absolutely. This is very interesting because these two competitors sitting here... um. 
He does not like Squirtle in this situation. No, no. Uh, um, Lucas is, actually has some kill potential behind him. Squirtle being as light as he is, definitely a smarter choice to switch to the Ivysaur at this stage. Um, Cause he can potentially die at 80 by just by, you know, all of Lucas's smash attacks pretty much. Psychedelic, it seems like the idea is to shield pressure from range, however, it does not seem to be effective. Certainly was before. You saw that shield getting smaller and smaller, Dan. Mm -hmm. However, back on stage and back into advantage goes Psychedelic. Oh, I don't know if uh, you're going to get... switching the Charizard, though, getting the seismic toss and util utilizing that platform to aid in that kill. And Dan the man going to take that first game. So game number one going to Dan the man. And now all of a sudden... We're uh, we're going to game number two. I'm not really sure what the counter pick is here, for uh, not really sure what the counter pick is here for for Psychedelic, who did so well to get here, beating Jay Moosh two to one, as well as uh, I believe beat Infinite Omega if I'm not mistaken two nil. Mm. So, good stuff from Psychedelic to even make it this far. But Dan the Man posing a different kind of threat. He'll need the reverse 2-0 if he wants to make it to winner semis. Absolutely. And um, well, what did you see Psychedelic do well in that game one? Well, in your opinion, in my opinion, Pokemon even though he uh, he lost, he was spacing himself out well, utilizing the PK fire, so he was out of range in most of the kill options that Ivysaur was <laughs> that Dan the Man actually opted to use. Also. I find this very interesting, G uh, game number two on Smashville, but yeah, like I said, utilizing his space, like that's what Lucas does best, um, having those PK uh, attacks out as well, also have having that disjoint on the floor there, th utilizing these things, trying to just stay out of Ivysaur's range of the kill potential or the damage output, very well utilized, but Dan the Man uh, showing that he knows his character. He's here to play and already 60% and counting. And a great. Oh my. The Vine Whips. Watch me whip. Watch me take the first stock, says Dan the Man. And only at 55%. Oh, maybe going where Eagles dare there. And putting the pressure on Psychedelic, who does not like people in his face, it seems like. Makes you wonder why he was hanging around that long against that Ivysaur, who again, you uh, don't necessarily want everyone in your face if you're Ivysaur, but you do have your options. And now, wow. the Flare Blitz. Oh, looking for that shield pressure. Psychedelic says, get that mess out of my face. Smacks him off the stage and takes away stock number one. Absolutely, but we find Dan the Man sitting center stage still um, in a comfortable 80% lead now. Doesn't really want to approach too much in this in this um, setting, but Ooh. psychedelic definitely making it hard for him um, here. So he's gonna have to um, find find some more tools uh, to get around this uh, spacing game and just try to net that kill. Gotta say, when that vine whip comes out, it comes out with intent, and he has seldom missed with that in these uh, in these two games. That up smash from Dan the Man going to take stock number two. Unfortunate uh, recovery coming from Psychedelic. Uh, uh, yeah. Recovering above the ledge, um, making it easy for Dan the Man to get that easy, uh, net that easy kill. And oh, all he had to are. do was stand there. Exactly. And or so sit there. I'm not really sure what <laughs> Ivysaur does with his short <laughs> legs. Yes, yes, exactly, Stu. Oh, 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 oh my. And the, just like that, wow. Dan the Man, excuse you. The that was, that the was, was rude. That was that was inconsiderate. Did you even consider Psychedelic's feelings, Dan? Oh, my gosh, Dan. That was just, <laughs> wow, like the down air through the stage. Dan catching bodies right and left here. At the monthly, he'll go on to winners. That Dan? was the most fun.